But I have a question for you guys. Which soundbar are you using right now? And what is your opinion on it? Let me know in the comments. Number 5. Yamaha YAS209 – Best for the Money Yamaha's YAS209 is one of our favorite soundbars for $500 or less for three basic reasons. It sounds great for the money, it's easy to set up and use, and it's absolutely loaded with features. While the YAS209 doesn't offer Dolby Atmos, for that you'll want to move one slot down, it offers everything you need at a great price, including a spare HDMI input for your favorite gaming console or streaming box, virtual surround sound, Wi-Fi streaming, Amazon Alexa voice assistant, and more. While the 209 sound performance can't match up with expensive audiophile systems or bars with multiple upfiring drivers for Dolby Atmos immersion, it brings it for its price point. Detail is impressive, bass response from the wireless sub is smooth and powerful, and dialogue is easy to make out thanks to the clear voice EQ feature. The Yamaha YAS209 offers excellent sound in a compact size. Amazon Alexa is useful, and the mics work well in loud environments. The soundbar's implementation of DTS Virtual X offers a rich sound effect. The subwoofer is more articulate and offers more headroom than the competing Polk soundbar. This is a soundbar capable of delivering big, weighty movie soundtracks with expertly placed and exciting surround effects, while also ensuring crucial elements such as dialogue are clear and well projected. It gets a huge amount right, but there are a few niggling flaws, and the excellent standards of the class mean you can buy even better for similar money. Number 4. Bose Smart Soundbar 700 – Best Smart Soundbar This one looks pretty cool, sounds amazing, has tons of smart features, and provides a great soundstage. The price is right as well, and I don't think anyone doubts Bose by now. Without further ado, let's take a closer look at it. The Bose Soundbar 700 has its connectivity ports on the back of the device, and there are plenty of them. The ports include HDMI, optical digital input, Ethernet port, and a micro USB port for service and updates in the first recess. In the other one, you'll spot a 3.5mm jack for subwoofer, data, IR extender, and adapt IQ. Single HDMI output port supports eARC for better performance. The Bose Soundbar 700 supports Wi Fi connectivity, AirPlay 2, and Bluetooth. In the package of the Bose Soundbar 700, you'll also spot a well-made universal remote control with metal construction. The Bose Soundbar 700 has millions of features in the package, most importantly the Amazon Alexa and Google Assistant to allow you easy operation. You'll have to download the Bose app to your smartphone to activate its full capabilities. The sound performance of this beast comes from four mid-range drivers with a phase guide technology to provide a great experience. The Adapt IQ technology also provides a great effect by analyzing the sound in the room to adjust the sound to your needs. Bose has done one heck of a job with this one. Number 3. Sonos Playbase – Best Compact Soundbar The Sonos Playbase fills a gap in the Sonos system, albeit a small one. For those wanting a Sonos TV speaker that sits directly underneath your TV, as opposed to somewhere near, like a soundbar, you now have an option. The Sonos Playbase is far from the first device of its type then, but being a Sonos product, it's neater, more stylish, and streamier than practically any rival too. It may be simple, but the Playbase is also very solid and able to support TVs weighing up to 35 kilograms. These days, only truly huge tellies tend to tip the scales over that sort of weight, and if you've got a telly with really widely positioned feet, the Playbase is short enough that it'll almost certainly fit under the TV and between them. Should you have any issues with the placement or just fancy an even neater setup, you can buy a wall bracket. None of this would matter if the Playbase didn't sound good, but we're happy to report that it does in fact sound quite good. Even without true play calibration, the Playbase offered punchy bass, crisp vocals, and a good sense of soundstage depth and height. Overall, we enjoyed our time with the Sonos Playbar and ended up liking it a lot. It made playing music so simple that we wanted to have music playing at home all the time. Number 2. Samsung HWQ90R – Best High-End Soundbar Ultimately, the Samsung HWQ90R is a superb soundbar, and when it comes to Dolby Atmos and DTS-X, it's unmatched. If you want to add immersive audio to your living room but don't want the complexity and mess of installing a 9-channel AV receiver and 5.1.4 speaker system, then the Samsung is the ideal alternative. 
The HWQ90 isn't cheap, but to get a system approaching this level of performance would require buying a minimum 9-channel AV receiver and a 5.1.4 speaker package. The chances are that such a system would cost at least as much as the Samsung system, and it wouldn't be as easy or unobtrusive to install. The adaptive sound mode is skillful at teasing more detail out of the soundtrack, but tends to work best with sports broadcasts or dialogue-driven programming. For something like The Expanse, the surround mode is a good choice because it upmixes the soundtrack to use the overhead channels, creating a more enveloping experience. At first glance, the Samsung HWQ90R appears rather expensive for a soundbar. However, once you consider its capabilities, you start to realize it offers surprising value. If you wanted to build an equivalent 5.1.4 channel system using separates, you'd find it hard to achieve for less than the cost of a soundbar speaker sub combo. Number 1. Sonos Arc – Best Overall The brand new Sonos Arc soundbar packs an immersive Dolby Atmos experience into a slim package. Whether you place it on your TV stand or mount it to the wall directly beneath your television – the wall mount is sold separately – you'll be instantly impressed with the performance. The Arc from Sonos is a streamlined soundbar that offers a premium surround sound experience without the need for supplementary speakers. If you want a minimalist surround sound package and you have a squarish home cinema room, then the Sonos Arc is an excellent all-in-one surround sound system. The 11 built-in speakers, two in the top of the soundbar, one at either end and the rest front-facing, not only produce exquisite detail from movies, TV shows or games that you're enjoying, they also envelop you in the sound thanks primarily to the top and side speakers and the soundbar. Bass response is tight and deep thanks to the dual bass drivers that Sonos employed in the Arc's design. Need more bass? No problem! Add the Sonos Sub for even more impact. Since the Arc is intended to bounce audio off the roof and walls of your room to create a 3D soundscape, it's wrapped on the top, front and either end by metal hole-punch speaker grills that cover the various orientations of the Atmos driver array. The Sonos Arc is one of the best speakers we've heard for audio separation making it great for enhancing your surround sound experience. Buying Guide Size and Placement Soundbars are the best-selling type of television speaker because they are the perfect match for today's flat-screen TVs. They're thin, low-profile, and sit right under the TV. It's unusual to find yourself in a situation where there isn't enough room for the soundbar, but you do want things to be consistent. For example, if the soundbar is going to be paired with a small 32-inch TV, you might want a compact soundbar like the Bose Solo 5, which is 21.6 inches wide. You probably don't want a 40-inch soundbar that's wider than the TV. You'll also want to consider whether you'll place it on the TV cabinet or have it wall-mounted. Sound Most movies and TV shows we've tested during our soundbar reviews have excellent sound quality with Dolby decoding systems included. To make sure the sound is clear and 100% audible from any distance, you would need your soundbar to decode Dolby technology. Many soundbars you see in the market may be designed with auto-tuning features for top-notch performance as well. They can come with built-in sound modes to provide superior sound for any form of media, such as music and movies. Channels Channels refer to how many speakers or points of sound emission a soundbar has. The less channels available in a soundbar, the less three-dimensional the effect will be. To get top-notch sound, it's good to choose a soundbar that comes with at least five channels, which is the industry standard. You want to have left, right, center, and two rear speakers to get the soundbar to release immersive sounds. Then again, you'll find a lot of great soundbars available in the market without five channels, like the Sonos Beam which is a slim three-channel soundbar that propels B 